Hey what's up guys, it's Crafty Fox, and today we are making the TTX boxcar. So here it is, and it's a 50 foot standard boxcar. Uh, I think the other size would be like 60 foot. Uh, but yeah, this is pretty much the normal, regular freight car, and you can use this on, um, I think any American freight uh, railroad they would use this, because TTX, they lease out their cars, uh, so other companies use it. And yeah, this is basically what it looks like. So yeah, let's get started. So the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna make the wheels. So uh, we're not making hopper wheels for this. We're using regular uh, gray concrete. So put one there on top of the tracks and then skip two blocks, put another pair. And in between, we're gonna have like this, sort of like this dip. It's gonna be the bogey with the two stone brick stairs uh, back to back, upside down. Same thing on uh, this side like so and then we're going to take stone brick slab and add it in between uh, right here in the bogey and uh, let me just pop open to see what's in okay so it's just wood so we're going to take um, oak wood slab just add a row of five across in the back of this wheel and then we're going to make uh, this section how many blocks long let's make it 15 blocks long so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And wow, we were right on the money with that. I was just totally guessing how long it was. Now it's right, so that's pretty good. So yeah, we're gonna fill this all in. And it's gonna be like the bottom of the box car. We can just go across the entire way. And this tutorial won't be that long because it's only like one freight car. In the past, I think I did make a tutorial on like a box car, but uh, this is like the new and improved design. It has way more detail. It's way more accurate. And I accidentally deleted that, but it's not that big of a deal. I'll fix it later. So now we're going to make the back bogey. So I'm going to place that right there. Fire uh, gray concrete, skip two blocks ahead, and then add another pair of wheels. Uh, then we're going to have stone brick slab on the inside connecting it all together and stone brick stairs back to back upside down in between the wheels and I think my older one it did use hopper wheels but these block wheels are really good for uh, rail cars so now we're going to take a stone button just add it on the top or rather the side of it the wheel just for all parts and that's the last time we're going to use stone button for this. So now we're going to take out an oak wood uh, block. Just place one right there. And we're going to have a coupling, which is uh, another brick slab like so sticking out. And on this side, same thing as well. Bam. And then on the sides of that, we're going to have um, oak wood stairs, just like two on each side. So that's like their first layer, and we need to make a bunch of layers of this. So one, two, three, four. So there's four of these on top of this one. So actually for the next layer, it's a bit unique as well. We're gonna have a uh, yellow concrete, or rather yellow terracotta on uh, the right side. So I think that has something to do with the brake. It's just some detailing. And this is actually the brake valve, which is only on that side if you notice. So. Uh, go on the other side, just do the same thing, keeping that little uh, yellow box on the right hand side. Alright, cool. So now we can fill in the rest. Uh, oak wood stairs. Above it, another layer. And above that, another layer. And above that, yet another layer. So we should have uh, four of them on top of the original um, stairs down below. So after you do this side, let's go on to the other end. Just match it up. So one, two, three, and four. Then just go across yet again making it all evened out. 
and even right before I was starting this tutorial video I just realized some stuff that was missing so even if you think your build is a hundred percent good and there's probably something wrong with it that you never even notice all right so now we're going to take quartz stairs just add it upside down around the top at the edges so the top edges uh, they're kind of white so I use quartz for that with a quartz slab on top same thing on the other side and once we do that we can do the roof which is pretty simple to do and add our slabs alright for the roof we're gonna have stone slab three blocks in the middle and we're gonna extend that to the rest of the roof to the other side it's gonna take us a bit of a while to get there but we will eventually do it and let me know if you want like a 60 foot uh, car tutorial if that's necessary or you're just fine with this 50 foot box car all right so then we're to take uh, oak wood slab just add that on the sides like this you can see the Siemens charger in the background I do have to do the Amtrak Escades one though and also the charger I mean for a bright line alright so now uh, we're gonna have yellow terracotta and we need to make this section so that's going to be I'm gonna guess 10 blocks long or maybe 9 let's do 9 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 seven eight okay so it's eight not nine let me do eight on the other side just to make sure one two three four five six seven eight all right so apparently it's just eight like that yellow terracotta and just try to make everything match up then we're gonna take a black concrete and we're gonna add in like a tower in on the inside like this like on the very uh, edges of this door we're gonna have black concrete and that's just so that it doesn't have like a hole in the door because that's just how I made it so we're gonna have like these pillars that go all the way up and then we're gonna have yellow terracotta around it on the outside not in front of it And the yellow terracotta it just goes around the top as well, so let's do that it's right there. And then this side. Go to the other side, same thing. Goes up and around. And the last one, right over here. Go around. And we can also add in like uh, pillar right here on the edge so it's kind of like a rectangle or yeah it's definitely a rectangle it's not a square so once we do that we can also take uh, black concrete go to this side add it to the right hand side just add three black concretes in this top corner go to the other side same thing and that's just gonna say TTX and the rest of that is just yellow terracotta so let me just fill that in Then this side, just do this. And I also do want to redo the tank car because I think the original one is not that great. Okay, so now um, let's take gray concrete, go on the left hand side, add one right here, skip a block, add another one. Then we're going to have yellow terracotta in between and on the layer on top so it looks like this same thing on the other side then you'll terracotta all right so now we're gonna have um, that symbol right there so we're gonna take red concrete and go above the middle of these two gray concretes add red then go diagonally up towards the right side and just put lapis so that's our little symbol that we have 
same thing on the other side so just put that in the middle and the rest is just yellow terracotta so that's pretty easy then we're gonna work a bit on the door and I think we're uh, almost done after that we do need a little bit more like the brake valve which I probably will forget so let me do that right now so let's take a wooden trap door just place that uh, right over here on the left hand side that and that's gonna be what you turn off well what you turn to uh, brake the rail car manually I think and uh, yeah so the last part I think is the door so for the door we're gonna use uh, nether brick stairs so let's start from the top so gonna have upside down and then right side up that's that's pretty much the pattern we just do that all the way up and all the way down so let me do that on all four corners it's kinda like a C shape then this side and the last side alright so then in this part um, yeah we're just gonna repeat the same thing so whatever you did on um, this side you just repeat it so it kinda like faces the same exact direction so let me do that right now this side and the last one alright so now once we're done with that we're going to connect them all together so just have one facing outwards so that they combine so we'd have that just switching back and forth and the last one over here on the side and I think after that we'll be done but I'm gonna look around just in case alright you see that the door is finally sealed off so that's pretty good so let me take a brief inspection and uh, yeah that's pretty much it on how to build the TTX boxcar 50 foot length so I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you do remember to hit that like button below and subscribe if you had already because I will be uploading more videos like this in the future and if you have any suggestions you can leave them in the comment section below but anyways guys I'll see you guys next time bye